what's up beautiful and handsome people welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel in case you're new here hello my name is tracy and welcome to herself tracy ganda a place for lifestyle beauty and entrepreneurship content and since today is money thursday we're going to be talking about money issues so if you're new here and you love money I think we all do love money so if you're new here please go ahead and hit that subscription button and if you're all here but you've never hit that subscription button please go down there and hit it i'm waiting also as you're there turn on your notification bell so that you shall be notified whenever i upload a new video every thursday and sunday and i cross my heart guys every thursday and sunday i'm so sorry i haven't been consistent because certain things happened and i got so busy and i had made certain content to be released during that time but then it wasn't really nice so i decided to not to produce i decided not to post bad content instead so i decided to wait a little bit till when i was free enough to record but without boring you with all that if you don't follow me on my instagram and snapchat youtube tiktok please go ahead and do that i'm going to leave all the pages down below all the links down below because i usually post job opportunities onto there so if you're interested in such a thing please follow me on my social media platforms and without anything else let's dive into the video so today we are going to be talking about this thing our mind but our mind with money money mindset yeah so today we're going to be talking about money mindset what kind of mindset should you have what things should you let go of? but what is mindset money mindset is an attitude i'm sorry i'm looking down because i'm just copying through my notes because we are racing against light and time your girl has to be at work very soon so i have to rush finish this then go to work yeah so money mindset is an attitude that you have about finance it drives how you it drives how you make key financial decisions every day and it has a great impact on the decisions that you make about your goals about your money about your work about anything that you want to invest in so what kind of mindset do you have about money take for instance right now what kind of thoughts do you have about money are you thinking you're never going to make it because we've been at home for a very long time i know so many people have lost their jobs so many companies have closed during this time because they've run out of business so are you that kind of person that's feeling man i can never make money do you have that kind of mindset if you do we have to let go of that and let's see what are the proper what are what are the other characteristics of a good mindset a good money mindset so a person with a good mindset is not intimidated by money what is intimidation where you feel like you just can't make it you're just scared of money because of maybe some things that your your parents or your relatives used to tell you as you are growing up like in my language there is something that people usually say some old people will tell you if you want a lot of things all of the centers around the community and uh, the translation for that is do you think money is picked off a tree and that that kind of thing makes can make you feel like money is too hard it's too hard to get but that's not the case because if anybody else can make money then you too can make money because we're all created by the same goods da 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 we can all make the money so the second thing is procrastination you do not procrastinate if you know that this is my job i have to be there at that time then you try and do your things right so that you can achieve your goals the other thing is fear fear is the same as intimidation um the feeling that money always leaves you you know we live in an era where you the money that you earn from from paycheck to the stomach to rent and it's all done like you just you get money then it leaves you immediately you just don't have you don't have savings you don't have any money kept for yourself like that kind of thing that's a bad money mindset so we are going to correct it and let's see the characteristics of a good money minded person looks for opportunities instead of seeing roadblocks like you just put yourself out there and even if it fails you just lift yourself up and repeat again you value asking people for help instead of just keeping quiet and you suffer silently you cherish small steps like 
always be grateful guys always be grateful for everything me i'm super grateful for literally everything even if it's something small even if i go out there and just earn five dollars i'm going to be very happy because those that small that five five dollars can add up and before you know it you have a hundred a thousand and yeah you have money so let's see some of the things that you should let go some of the things that you should let go and some of the things that you should do in order to have a proper mindset first forget about the things that they might have told you when you are growing up things like what is the center of the document do you think money is got off a tree don't don't be thinking through that kind of mm, as that kind of way money is something that can be gotten so set your mindset try from today onwards try and think that i can get money i'm capable of getting money money is not all that hard as long as i do something that i'm passionate about something that i like something that i really really love and because like i told you guys in my previous video in a video of mine not the previous one but a video of mine that i'll link up here or up here i'm sorry i'm rambling but we're going to go through this so what was I saying? Is that me? <laughs> <laughs> oh my hmm? god. Mom. <laughs> yes, I was saying, I was saying, make sure you do something that you love, something that you're passionate about. If you're passionate about human hair, sell that because when, when you're doing something that you love, you'll put it on nicely, you'll comb it, you will take care of it because you love it. And someone else will come and buy that thing because they see how much effort you put into that thing yeah so make sure you do something that you like and if you do that money is not going to be difficult to earn it's not going to be very hard to earn second forget about your past like in this in this aspect i mean like take, take for instance you you had a business before covid and now the business has cherished and you're just scared of doing business anymore you're like ah business ah then me i'm going to go and they employ me but you are a business owner but now you're taking the other route no 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 you don't have to do that i'll give you my own example i have done several businesses guys i have invested my money in several things some people even scammed me i'll tell you about that sometime make sure you guys don't laugh at me but i have done several things for money and some things haven't worked out for sure i felt bad i i had a few days of crying over those things and just feeling like i just can't do it again but after a while i lift myself up and I'm like, Tracy, let's now go, let's let's get this money. So that's the kind of attitude I want you guys to have. Don't think that just because you had a previous business that went into losses, even this one is going to go into losses. No, 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 you're going to make it. For sure, you're going to make it. So we're not thinking about anything from the past year. We are going in front. Third, fake it till you make it, guys. Just fake it. Some people put on ten verses. Some people sell clothes and they can't even afford those clothes. I sell clothes and I can't afford some of those clothes. Like if you're that kind of person, just dress nicely till, yeah, till you can you can just get rich a time and you can buy buy all those clothes. For lack of a good example, that's the one I use. You guys can understand. Fake it till you make it. We've had this saying several times, and I know that you guys can come up with examples. Fake it till you make it. If you are, let's say, a forex trader, do it and do it and do it and do it till you make it. I am a teacher. Before, when I started to teach, I didn't know anything about teaching. Like, I am an ESL teacher and there's some things that you have to do that we never did in my country. But I faked it till I made it. And right now, whenever I just go and teach and do a demo, people like my classes. But it's not that I was the best teacher that has ever been. No, no, no. I faked it till I made it. So, I want you guys to have the same attitude. So, guys, I must apologize. I sort of increased my brightness way too high. And... As you can see, the color was not really nice, so I had to change the effect. I hope this doesn't affect how you feel about the video. Thank you so much for watching. Number four, set a vision a vision board. This is where you, you write the things that you want to achieve in life. And every single day you work towards those things. So even if you, some negative mindset comes into your head, you're not going to give in. You're going to work towards that thing. So guys you should set a vision board. number five practice gratitude be thankful for every single small thing that you achieve 
like I talked about at the beginning of be grateful even if it's a small step like I said even if you earn five dollars that five dollars times ten that's fifty dollars before you have you, you before you know it you will have a hundred dollars so be grateful be thankful because if you're thankful about the five dollars you're going to be wanting to get the other five dollars but if you underlook it and you're like it's just like a five dollars then you might not even go back to that job but be thankful and be grateful for every single for a lack of a good example i've used that but i hope you guys get it number seven love money to have a good money mindset you must fall in love it's just like a boy to have a good attitude towards that person you have to love that person so guys love money stop thinking money is the root to all evil why is it that some rich people still do charity work they, they would be selfish but you find that the richest people are the ones that do the most charity okay maybe because they have enough money to do that but love money guys appreciate money like it when you see it love it love it love money i love money guys my friends know it my family knows it i love money money i love you so you guys should love money that will help you have a good money mindset last one set huge goals set goals that can't even allow you to have a bad mindset towards money yeah i sometimes think that maybe president obama once had a dream that he wanted to be the president of america and he worked towards it and he achieved it so guys set huge goals set a goal that cannot allow you to procrastinate for that long set a goal that cannot let you stay in bed when you have a, when you have work to do set a goal that wakes you up set a goal that lifts you up set a huge huge goal i know this video has been a little bit quick but i hope you guys have enjoyed it and i hope you've learned, learned something please give me a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and turn on that notification bell so that you shall be notified whenever i upload a new video every sunday and thursday I love you guys so so much i'm sorry i'm rushing i have to go to work i think i should take you guys to work maybe i might record that clip and put it at the end of this video i love you guys so much be safe and i hope you're doing well don't forget to follow me on my instagram tiktok snapchat and where else facebook and facebook i love you guys so much and i'm going to appreciate all of you guys that are going to watch this video because i know i haven't been posting in a while so you guys might have given up on me or became frustrated but i love you i love you i love you i love you guys thank you for thank you so much for supporting my youtube channel see you on sunday i have something fun and then next week we're going to be talking about the jab 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 mm?